Yes, and, uh, and in closing, I do want to thank the Ann Arbor Dems for hosting this. Um, I also want to thank some of my supporters, including um, my husband, Graham Teal, uh, the mayor of Ann Arbor, John Heapja, Honorable John Dingle. Uh, I'm also appreciative of the support and the endorsement of several local unions, including the IBEW, Iron Workers, and the Huron Valley Central Council, uh, Central Labor, Co Labor Council of the AFL-CIO. Um, I believe strongly that we need to address uh, both change and how we move forward in, uh, in the city. I think that in terms of supporting local businesses and neighborhoods, part of that is certainly economic development. And, and that's in, it's so important to have density downtown, uh, frankly, to support those businesses. And all of the merchants are very appreciative of what we are trying to do in terms of bringing them more business. Um, in terms of our budget priorities, we started prioritizing safety services and the budget when I got on council in 2002. This has always been a high priority for all of us. Um, it hasn't been easy. It has not been easy in this kind of a recession to try to build your safety services and to try to maintain um, a strong budget, but we've done it. We, uh, we turned the corner several years ago, and I think that the fact that we're hiring in the police department and, uh, and fire uh, is a great indicator of how healthy our budget is and how, uh, how great we're doing as a city. I want to keep that moving forward, um, and I want to keep moving forward with, uh, in a collaborative manner with all of my fellow city council members.